accepting me and giving me this beautiful opportunity to see this arangetram it's such a pleasure for me and you know we have to give a big if i can request and if you all don't mind let's give them a beautiful standing ovation please can we have they really deserve that they thank you thank you that was such a wonderful uh, bharatanatyam and it's the best arangetram i've ever seen in my life and i also want to really call out the dance teacher guru shrimati preeta arun for all the efforts that she's put in to bring the best in those three that's an amazing job and i'm sure it's not a easy feat to achieve and the reason why i'm so emotional about this performance is that i know being in technology how difficult it is to manage just home and office you know normally what happens um, i'm sure many of you all are in it industry as well you have very very tight projects at uh, office you would be taking innumerable calls even after coming home and i'm sure probably you've switched off the camera and the zoom and practicing taking your calls and still practicing your dance right and also being a working woman taking care of the house taking care of the household chores preparing your kids especially in this exam seasons making sure they're getting 90 plus in their subjects and being a good wife mother mother in law all these things just all these things takes 24 hours but on top of this 24 hours all the three have squeezed in many many more hours in order to provide this beautiful performance and you know what many of my colleagues at office um, come and ask me hey how do we manage because managing home and work is so difficult next time when somebody comes and asks me i know whom to send them for advice yeah and you know literally when i was when you were ending the performance with the tilana and namaskaram i had tears not just for the performance but the efforts that's put in the sacrifices you three have done and the sacrifices from your family members who's here to support you a big round of applause for all your family members and and i could see on the side stage your family members fanning and giving you electrol and water and that was just amazing and it was such a proud moment and this is a role model that everybody should try to em emulate in their lives and and this reminds me of one story from steve jobs i'm sure all of you all would have heard about it steve jobs in 1972 he joined the reeds college because he wants to really uh, complete his graduation because that was his dreams for the parents but he dropped out um, because he didn't find value and guess what he got into a calligraphy class when and little did he know why he's doing calligraphy because he knows his interest is in tech and so on but after 10 years when he found apple he used those calligraphy skills to find the fonts and the beautiful letters that we see in the computer right now that was a trend setter in the entire industry and in a speech he says if he is not taken that calligraphy class and worked on that art form he would never be able to find the font for the entire industry and he says life is all about connecting the dots and i feel you've kept a nice big beautiful dot now and this dot is going to connect to something much more purposeful both in your purpose, personal life and your professional life thank you